okay, okay. We only travelled 18 kilometres from our stop last night and we have diverted off State Highway 8 and we are now Freedom Campaign at a little spot called Lake Rua Tanifa. A beautiful spot, beautiful spot. What? Well, all spots are beautiful in the Mackenzie district. But this is going to be our stop here for tonight. Don't know, maybe two. And uh, yeah, we might go for a bit of a wander around and see what's in the area. So we left our camping spot on the shores of Lake Ruatanifa and we travelled just a short distance, um, had a little bit of a ticky tour around the Twizel area and we are now parked up at Ohau Canal B, um, right beside one of the hydro canals. There are actually 58 kilometres of different hydro canals in and around the Mackenzie district and um, we are parked up here. NZMCA actually lease this land off Meridian and members can park here and we're right beside the canal and that makes it easy just to be able to drop our line in and hopefully catch, catch some trout or salmon uh, but I have defrosted some steak for tea just in idea. case Scotty's just come in from his uh, first attempt at doing a little bit of fishing and it is a big fat Zero. Yeah, pitiful. I think it's steak for tea. Yeah. So the Mackenzie or Waitaki Hydro Canals, it's, they're a series of man-made canals which join the three lakes, that being Tekapo, Ohau and Pukeki. Um, and you know they may look a little bit bland in appearance, beautiful turquoise water, but they do provide many kilometres, as I mentioned earlier, 58 kilometres, of outstanding fishing, mainly large trout and salmon, apart from when Scott puts his line in the water. Mm -hmm. 